Well, check it out tonight. This fireball is just part of a normal day at the Crane Army Ammunition Activity Center. In fact, workers there destroy ammunition that can't be used to free up some storage space for working bombs and bullets. In fact, this is just part of the work that goes on at the Southern Indiana base. And today, our own Rich and I got to go inside of the base at Crane to show all of us how the Hoosiers are working there and how they're helping the Army keep all of us safe. The Army takes care of and provides the ammunition for all of the U.S. Armed Forces. And $9.8 billion worth of bullets, bombs, and other ammo are right here at Crane. One quarter of the United States military's conventional ammunition is stored in 1,800 locations around the base. I take great pride in what I do. Uh, at the end of the day, knowing that my mission is to get the material out to the warfighter so they accomplish their mission. The workforce of about 800 civilians is responsible for inventory, inspection, production, and even destruction of unusable ammunition. Without the hardworking Hoosiers uh, that come here every day, roll up their sleeves and get the job done, uh, we couldn't do what we do here. Uh, and what we do here is, is pretty awesome. It is spectacular uh, when you look at the grand scheme. 2,000-pound bombs as old as the 1970s are renovated at a cost savings of about $10,000 over new. Inspectors ensure quality before any ammo leaves Crane. We're the last eyes, so that when the, the warfighter gets it, they don't have no questions, and, and as my shirt says, click bang freedom, that when they open it up, when they click, hit that trigger, that it does what it's supposed to do and goes bang to ensure our freedom. Damaged and outdated ammunition goes up in smoke at the ammunition burning ground. This is a naval base, third largest in the world, but the Army ammunition activity takes up 51,000 of the 64,000 square acres of this massive facility. In Crane, I'm Rich Knight, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. The Crane opened back in 1941 as a naval ammunition depot located safely inland. The Army took over all ammunition activity in 1977.